my mask is completely dry now. I can't even like smile or anything. Um, I'm hoping it's gonna come out in one piece because if you can see closely, like it's see how it's like breaking like this. I'm gonna attempt to take it off in one piece because I packed it on that's why I packed it on because I wanted it to come out one piece because sometimes when I don't pack it on it comes out in little pieces but if you see from the bottom it's like already removed itself like it unhinged from my skin so you see so it looks like it's gonna come out in one piece see so I'm just sitting in the balcony for a minute, just taking a little bit of air, enjoying the weather. Look, it's so nice out today. I'm looking at the time and now it's just like the time flies. It flies. Soon it'll be time to go pick up my little bubba. Um, and then I just found out that the condo is rented and I have to go there late on tonight to make sure everything is um in order all the towels are out everything is clean so i have to do that later on and um basically that's it you know those two lines i say i hate here you see how the mask cracked right on them it's so annoying i hate those if i ever become rich that is the first thing i'm doing fill it right in here because I did it, it didn't work. It came right back. But I'm going to pause you guys for a second. And then I'll go inside and I'll remove the mask. Okay, guys? See you in two seconds. I'm back, guys. Okay, so here you have the mask dried. Completely dried. So this is part two of the first one that I did when I applied it. I'm going to attempt to take it off. I hope it comes off in one piece. And this is not an epic fail. If it is, because one time, the first time I ever did it, I guess I didn't put enough glue. So it was coming out in pieces. So I just have my handy cloth here. I just uh, wet it with warm water. And I just rub off whatever is left on my face. I rub it off. So, I'm always ready if something fails, but hopefully this will come off. It already came out from here, the bottom, as you can see. See? See that? Oof. And it hurts. <laughs> it doesn't hurt. You just feel the pulling, but that's good because that means it's like pulling out everything like all the blackheads it'll pull out all the fuzzies you have like on your face the little hairs oh but because you have like hairs in your face when you pull it it can like hurt not like a excruciating pain that you can't handle but you just feel it like pulling the hair but see guys it's just like a charcoal mask all you have to do is buy the the charcoal capsules. Again, they sell these things in the dollar store, like the vitamins. I haven't seen the charcoal in the vitamin store. Let me take a break. Oof. I haven't seen them in the vitamin store because they think that, I mean, in the dollar store. I haven't really looked in there for them. I, it did take me a long time to find them. I looked in CVS, Walgreens, Walmart, everywhere, and I couldn't find them. Finally, where I found them was in the GNC. So I'm just going to stay quiet for a minute and just pull it off so we can get, like, that satisfaction and I don't distract you from the talking because this is, what is it that my son calls it? It's, um, he calls it, I forgot what's the word he uses, when he likes the way something is, like when you're doing something, he says he gets like a satisfaction out of it, like, I forgot the word he uses, but anyway, here we go, okay?
See where, where I feel it tugging? It's like right here, because you know you have like the little bits of hair. But I'm telling you this works. When you look at it, you see it takes out every single blackhead. This is like the Bior. You know how you buy the pack of the Bior? <laughs> That's what this is like. I put so much of it, I layered so much on top of it that there's certain spots that you could still feel that it's a little uh, damp, like not wet yet. I mean, not completely dry, but for the most part, it is, it's just like, uh, I feel it like pulling my little hairs that I have, like, like my little baby hairs that I have here. Ooh. Oh, I came out in one whole piece. I'm so happy. Oof, there you go, guys. Let me see if I can. This is the back of the mask. See, it came off in one piece. My skin, it feels like it pulled everything out and it feels. So smooth. Let me see if I can see anything on it. Usually when you turn it over, you can see like little hairs. Yep, you can. I don't know if the camera will pick it up. But I'm going to put it real close here. Like if you see like all the little hairs, I don't know if you can see it. I'm hoping you can. It pulls all the little hairs. Let me see the nose part. It takes out the black heads. It's, this is like the best thing. And, and you make it like, I'm telling you, you can use it. Like, look at, it pulled out my little hairs from up here. Wow. You don't have to spend a lot of money. You can get a hundred uses with those capsules. Just you just gotta be careful not to like make a mess. But I can see it. I don't know if the camera is picking up on it. All the little hairs, like you can see them here. That's all that stuff it picked up. So this was not a, a fail. And then I'll take um until I jump in the shower, I'm just going to refresh my face with cotton ball and the access, like these little bits that are left over yes, that is when I start. with the micellar water. This is the best thing also, micellar water. And then you just clean the rest off. And look how easy it comes out. Sit. Satisfax satisfying that's the word when I'm doing something my son will say oh that's so satisfying so that's why I was saying that I was gonna stay quiet while I was pulling it so I can get that satisfying feeling and not be talking while I'm doing it but let me tell you something out of all the times that I've used this mask that I've made it this is the best that has come out like this. Like sometimes, a lot of the times I don't get it out in one whole piece like that. Like today, 
and it felt like it just pulled everything out. Like it was like really strong. Like I had a bunch of hair here. And look, if you see, it's smooth. It took out all that hair. I don't have no more hair here. My face feels really, really smooth. It pulls out all the blackheads. It's really, really cool. And that's it. And there you go. Beautiful skin. Now the next thing I'm gonna do because I wax my eyebrows in the where I do my nails and actually I don't know if you can see how long the hairs are. That's because again I put the castor oil. So I don't want to do them myself. I want to have them professionally done because I'm trying to get my eyebrows very thick. But I don't let I do my lip myself. And what I use is the Nair. Hold on. I use the Nair and it's the face cream. And I just put it on my upper lip and I leave it there for just a little while. I usually apply it with a Q-tip, but oh, what the hell, I'm just gonna use my finger today. And apply it liberally. Am I saying it right? Liberally. Because if you don't apply enough of it, like if you apply a thin layer, it's not gonna burn the hair off because that's what this is doing, burning, like if you have any hairs. It's burning it off. And on this side too, guys, if you can see close, you don't see no hair here. I had, from, cause I get a lot of hair here. And all this up to here, I had all hair. And look, the mask, when I pulled it, look how smooth it is. And if you can feel my skin right now, I'm telling you, it's worth it to go and buy the charcoal tablets capsules open them up a dollar almost glue mix it the way i did put it liberally on your face because if you don't put like a thick layer you're not gonna get it to come off in one piece the way i had it and i know i speak by experience because i've done it so many times so now I, i'm getting the hang of it when I first did it, I did it in a thin layer, so I ended up having to take it out with my cloth, just like wiping it because it wasn't coming off. But this time I put enough glue and I put enough thick that is thick on the skin and I let it dry really good. And I still feel, my skin still feels like, it just has like a tingling sensation, like from, it's so heavy duty, like when you're pulling it, it has pulled to it, it's really good. Um, I love the way my skin feels right now. It's really soft. I love that it looks clear. The only thing is it took out my, ba my baby hairs that I had here because I went too high with it. But that's okay. Like I had hair here. But that's okay. Yep. So I leave this on just for a little while. Like not long because it will burn you. Um, just leave it on a, a few set Like a... I don't know, I, I just like eyeball it, I come and I keep looking in the mirror. When I see the little hairs look like they're burned, then I rinse it off. I don't really have a lot of hair in my face because I um, do this a lot. So I don't really let it get to the point where you're gonna have like a mustache and stuff. But yeah, so that's it for today. That's This is my part two, my, cho my charcoal mask was a success. And again guys, this is what I used. With the Elmo's glue, you mix it, you put it on your skin, you put it on thick, you let it dry really well, you start peeling from the bottom, and it takes out everything, blackhead, whiteheads, uh, dirt, any little fuzzies you have in your skin, it takes it all out, and then it leaves your skin really soft. And again, be careful, do not get it on your eyeballs, because you saw how, how hard it was to pull off. You put that on your hairs here, it's gonna rip your eyebrow off. Just like you saw it take out the little bit of hair I had here. But other than that, I'm happy. I'm so happy the way it came out. I will see you guys later. I'm gonna make another video later. I don't know about what, 
but I will be back later on. So I'm happy that you guys uh, were with me while I was making this video. And if you have any comments, please leave them below and please subscribe to my video. I love you guys. I hope you're enjoying your day and I'll see you later. Mwah.